Gotta look back to the stream, man. <laughs> you beat Lunatic Bear, but only by a few seconds. <laughs> Holy crap. What's up, guys? I was about to start this fucking stream literally on the dot, but I was watching fucking 12 Tone. I was watching 12 Tone, so, uh, yeah, I, uh, I was busy watching that. And I, I was kind of cool. Um, I'm still here every time I had the page open, actually. Lunatic Bear is here every time. He, he still wins. He always wins. He's a gamer. He never fucking loses. That's cheating. Yep, I win. Man, the competition's really tight today, ain't it? It's cheating when I open the page at 7.30 EST. <laughs> But I literally typed the link in. Wait, did you literally, like, you were like, he usually starts at about 30 minutes before he starts the game. And then you, like, you opened it. And then, like, 30, 10 seconds later, I opened it. Dude, you're more fucking punctual than me. That's crazy. I did some changes to the back end, which you probably, you guys probably won't notice nor care. I might probably, I mean, you definitely won't notice this, um, because it's a screen that you guys can't see. <clears throat> so I have this tiny screen that I used to like have OBS on, right? And it's, I think it's like a 16 by 10 or three by four aspect ratio. So you get that extra vertical real estate. It's kind of nice. Um, and usually I have it at just at 1080p because whenever I go to play um, the long drive, I need it to be at 1080p. Uh, otherwise, it looks really fucking stupid on the stream. Uh, but because I'm not playing the long drive for a while, I'm actually going to put it to the native resolution uh, which gives me the ability to see if the stream is being stupid. Uh, I can actually finally fucking see my CPU load and my bitrate. <laughs> the bitrate was the important one. Because knowing me, my internet will shit the bed and it will keep doing it uh, until I get a different provider. There's not really much I can do about it. <laughs> I contacted uh, an ISP in my area. What provider do you use? Uh, not important. <laughs> I don't disclose stuff like that. Especially not, at least not live. I'll uh, maybe off stream, but not on record. Um, but I. <clears throat> Actually, I might have mentioned it. I think I might have mentioned it, but I'm not going to do it now. Uh, but I I contacted a few ISPs in my area and I'm like, hey, he uses DSL. He thinks it's faster. <laughs> That's a joke. <laughs> DSL is what my fucking neighbors use, dude. <laughs> they use that shit. Uh, but no. So I contacted some uh, ISPs in my area and I'm like, hey, you guys are expanding your fiber optic network, right? And they're like, yes. I'm like, cool. Hey, so how much would it cost me to like just run a line out just for me? They're like, yeah, probably around $20,000. I'm like, oh, okay. Okay, um, if I, let's say I had that cash on hand, when is the soonest that you guys could get that out to me? If I were to contact you guys and be like, hey, I'll wire you the money tomorrow, when can I get this done? And they're like, hmm, maybe a year, maybe a year and a half from now. I'm like, um, what? Huh? Did you say a year and a half? They're like, yeah. Yeah, probably a year and a half. Rip off. It's fucking unbelievable. 
It's, uh, yeah, it's actually a fucking ripoff. I'm like, what do you mean I have to wait a year and a half? I'm giving you fucking $20,000 and you're gonna tell me to wait a year? You're kidding me, right? And they're like, no. So I'm like, what do you, what's the holdup? What am I waiting for? Why is it gonna take a year to a year and a half? And they're like, well, there's other, other customers that want their fiber optic network done. I'm like, yeah, but they're not paying $20,000. What the fuck? Give us a whole car and you still have to wait a year. It's what I mean, what like Tesla? That's like that's like buying a Tesla. You spend a hundred thousand dollars or thirty thousand dollars for a fucking car, and then maybe you might get it in the next century. <laughs> the fuck you price. Well, actually, it's funny that you mentioned the fuck you price because after I kind of badgered them about it, I'm like. Because the twenty thousand wasn't really a proper price tag, that was just what one of the people they kind of guesstimated the price. They're like, "Yeah, it might cost twenty thousand dollars. That's their usual rate. Um, that's how like usually that's about how long, how much it would cost. Um, for the length." I'm like, "Okay, can I get a price?" And they're like, "No." I'm like. Can I get a price? And they're like, okay, fine. A hundred thousand dollars. I'm like, huh? <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> I've spoken with people that fucking run a fiber. It's no way. They, they're like, yeah, we'd have to charge you for the fucking conduit. I'm like, you're not going to charge me for conduit. You run direct burial. Teslas are dog shit. And they're like 30,000 base for, it, I think. Honestly, Teslas, I'm never going to buy a Tesla. I would much rather buy literally any other EV because fucking Tesla has their stupid proprietary fucking charging connector. Um, it's like going to a fucking, uh, a, getting a Ford car and only being able to go to Ford gas stations. There should be standardization. They don't want to do it, so they give you an outrageous price, hoping that you say no, and you probably will. Well, that's ex I know that that's exactly what they're doing. That's exactly, absolutely, one hundred percent why they gave me the one hundred thousand dollar price tag, is to get me to fuck up. The problem is, I've worked with contractors before, and I know they do that. <laughs> <clears throat> It's stupid. But if you say yes anyway, they roll out the red carpet. Yeah, because you're spending a hundred thousand dollars on a twenty thousand dollar job, of course they're gonna roll out the red carpet. Of course they're gonna do it. <laughs> I like Teslas, but man, I can't get behind the price and the ex exclusivity. I you know what I can get behind? Okay. This is the one thing that, like, Teslas have going for them, right? It's the one thing I can get behind. It's the fucking panel gaps. You can fit a whole fucking person behind those things. <laughs> Dude, the fucking Cybertruck still has the fucking panel gaps. $30,000 car. Car is not even assembled right. <laughs> Also, they're using lithium ion batteries instead of fucking lithium ion phosphate. Phosphate. Yes, they're more fucking energy dense, but they're flammable. <laughs> lithium ion, not iron phosphate. If I iron phosphate are not flammable, but they're less uh, energy dense, and that's probably why they don't use them, because people, for some reason, want 300 miles to a single charge. Why well, there's so many explo explosive mods in Rain World? Probably because of the artificer. Speaking of which, I'm uh, there's a uh, th I have a short coming up tomorrow. I have a YouTube short gonna be going up about the me fucking taking a plunge into the fucking spicy soda. The scavengers explode, bats explode, and squid explode. Have you ever played fucking Streets of Rogue? They have a lot of explosions too. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, no, um, 
the problem is that Teslas have all these weird fucking things that they just don't need. A slugcat has a one in a, a one million chance every frame to explode. That's a great fucking mod. That's the kind of thing I'd see in like uh, Left 4 Dead, alongside of the um the Shrek uh flashlight. <clears throat> but yeah, no, I know that they got the Teslas got rid of the stocks for like lane to like activate your blinker. That's stupid. Um, I know people give Tesla's crap for like, um, you can't open the door if there's ice on it, right? Because the handle's like all slick and shit and like pop, it's in. Um, normal cars have that problem. Like I'll shit on fucking Tesla's all day long. Um, but yeah, no, they, uh, they also have problems. Uh, like, other cards also have that same problem. Uh, <laughs> I'm, like, I'm, like, thinking, like, Teslas have, like, a tendency to explode into balls of fire, but so did the Ford Pinto. <laughs> Upon rear collision. <laughs> What a, what a, there's so many good bits about Ford Pintos. Um, what other problems that they have? Um, what are your guys' thoughts on Tesla's or like cars having this really big infotainment, uh, screens? Like, what do you guys think of like having a big fucking tablet in the middle of your, of your car? Personally, I feel like. I prefer buttons because I can, like, you can feel them. You don't have to look at them. You just reach down, you find the button, you click. Screens you have to look at. Don't like it, you know? <clears throat> um, also, the speedometer for Teslas are not in, like, some sort of, like, inter instrument cluster. Um... Like, normal cars, you'll have, like, a speedometer right in front of you. You just glance down real quick. But with Teslas, they're on that screen to your right, and also the speedometer moves depending on what screen you're on. How do I know what speed I'm going? Because that's the fun part about cars, is that with an engine... I, I kind of know how fast I'm going by the sound of the engine. I don't even have to look at my speedometer half the time. I can just kind of hear it. But with a Tesla... Like, what do you do? <laughs> I, I would say, though, the, nice, the one nice thing about Tesla is the fucking uh, the camera system that is constantly rolling video. So if somebody comes up and goes, I'm gonna key the car, I'm gonna piss on the car, I'm gonna piss on his car, his $30,000 car, I'm gonna piss on it. I'm gonna piss on the moon too. And he pisses on it. And then his fucking tiny wiener and his face gets captured in HD. <laughs> Like, <laughs> that is a cool feature to be able to just capture moments like that, you know? Also, there have been no sightings of the, of that one kid whom shall not be never, shall never be named. <clears throat> now, I don't really know. I'm going to kind of more or less follow the instructions of the game as to where to go uh, to get the good ending. But if I become lost and I don't know what the next step is, I might ask you guys, what is the next step? And if I have to do that, I expect one answer and then and then no more. <laughs> you 
you can ask me how my day has been. Also, correct me if I'm wrong, have we raided that strawberry chick before? Or have we seen, I think we've seen her before. Or not strawberry, Kaylee Strawberry. Shoot, what was her name? I'm checking, hang on. Just one sec. Cause I, I could have sworn I've seen her before. Um. Luckily, I know almost nothing about what you have left to do. Oh, goody. I feel like we've watched Kaylee Strawberry, someone with a similar name before. Or something. Because we had, we had somebody that I rated a guy... And then that guy raided another guy, and I think it was Kaylee. And I think she was playing Dredge. Unless I'm thinking about another chick that also has the name uh, Strawberry somewhere. Am I going crazy? I'm not crazy. I'm normal. <laughs> also, I'm looking at Kaylee Strawberry's uh, viewership. Fucking... Wow, she grew fast. She had fucking uh, 20 followers uh, as of 90 days ago. And she was getting like one viewer for Elden Ring and then immediately started getting a boatload of viewers playing Elden Ring. It seems to me like I should fucking play Elden Ring. <laughs> And maybe some Hollow Knight. She's also been playing Hollow Knight. I'm... I'm stealing notes. Actually, how much even is Hollow Knight? I feel like that would be a good next game to play anyway. $15. Okay. I'll put this on my wish list. I also, I've been, I was recommended a game by a, a buddy, a, a friend of a friend. And uh, I don't know if you guys have heard of it. So Hollow Knight, yeah, yeah. Um, it's called The Long Dark. Have you guys ever heard of that one? It's like a, it's like a exploration survival game. But it looks, like, graphically, it looks like a Telltale game. Uh, and apparently, from the looks of it, it actually, it, it, the presentation, it looks more like a linear game than it is an open world game. We can probably buy it, play it on stream maybe once to get a feel for it. Ah, uh, wow, it only needs seven fucking gigabytes of space. Wow. Okay, wow. That's, uh, that's really nice. So fucking, uh, refreshing to be able to play a game that looks really nice and not have to download 100 gigabytes. That's nice. Um, but yeah, the, the Long Dark is probably gonna be one of those games that I'm gonna stream at 720p instead of 1080p. Actually, let me let me check how many people are even streaming um Hollow Knight. Let's find out. Oh. <laughs> oh, quite a few actually. Um Yeah, we got a lot of people here. Hollow Knight. <laughs> That's how it's pronounced. <laughs> Don't make fun of me, I'll cry. It goes up to five viewers because I accidentally opened up my own fucking page like an idiot. <clears throat> yeah, nine more minutes we'll launch up uh, the game and we'll we'll hopefully get through everything pretty quickly. And I won't be sitting there trying to beat like 
Asgore for another fucking hour. Wait, shit. Do I have to fucking beat Asgore again? And then Flowey? Or, or is it just gonna end? Is it just gonna skip the fucking fight? You wouldn't be giving yourself a fake extra viewer, would you? Would you? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> You know, it's funny, I've actually, I've seen a lot of people that have had to, um, I'm gonna be totally out of fucking, I'm gonna be really bad though, because I'm gonna be out of practice. I know I literally just fought him yesterday, also 10 seconds until ads play. Um, but this one Discord server, the 5M server I used to play on a lot, um, they had a guy that was like, like guaranteed botting his viewership and his follower count. Um, let me, you know what? I'm going to look up a Sully so I can tell you like how bad it is. Cause it was actually like despicable how much he fucking bought it. Uh, he was averaging like quote unquote 10 viewers. Most of those, like his chat was totally dead. Like, he wouldn't get messages for, like, at least 30 minutes, but then he'd have, quote-unquote, 10 to 20 viewers. Let me put it this way. It's, it was more dead than you guys are right now. <laughs> he also gained 2,000 followers in two hours and then lost those 2,000 uh, a few days later. You look at his Sully Gnome page and it's just a bunch of weird spikes and like, it looks really dumb. <laughs> a friend supposedly had 400 viewers on a stream, but on Twitch. But I look at him now and, uh... Well, I mean, it's, it's fine if you send watching. That's still respectable. That's still a good amount, right? <clears throat> um... The thing is, though, is that having 400 viewers, but then if you stop streaming for a while, like, yeah, your viewership's going to be lower. Um, like, th there could, like, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, it could have just, how, how long ago, how long? It streams, like, every day. So we went from 400 down to 7 in, like, a day? Yeah, that's, that's botted. That's not real. That's weird. Um, I kind of pride myself in not botting my viewership. Um, like, I got, uh, I got affiliate. But, like, I, I know a lot of people that would literally, they would pull up their stream on their phone and then their TV just to count as two extra viewers so they could average at least three um, and then maybe they'll, like, have their friend come in from time to time. But just to get that minimum requirement, they would do that. And I didn't do that because I'm like, what's the point? If affiliate is meant to be a big milestone, why would you fake it out? It's like, it's like, um, beating a game with a fucking, a fucking action replay. It's like, it doesn't, it doesn't count. <laughs> Why'd you do that? The only person you've played is yourself. <laughs> you've taken away the one big milestone and of like feeling of growth. And also, as a viewer, I go into a person's stream and they have like 10 or 20 viewers and I see their chats dead. I'm like, oh, it's probably bot. That's why I like to play every game on hard mode. Depends on the game though. Some games are like, like frustratingly difficult already. Like not even a fun kind of hard. Um, but it's also the reason that I just don't really like, I don't really want have any plans of playing any games with the viewers. So I like talking with you guys over the, over the chat. And I don't want people coming into my stream thinking his chat's dead, he's botting his shit. Because that is not the kind of vibe I want to be given off.
You know what I mean? I'd, ha I'd hate to have that be a thing. Um, but also when I go to raid people, I also check their chat. Like, I, I, I go to check how active is their chat. And if it's not active, it's probably botted. Or something's wrong, like there's something going on. It's either it's botted or they just don't really interact with their chat as much as they should. They have viewers, but they're not really there for them. They're not talking. Ah. Uh, also, I, I will never rate a guy that has fucking followers only chat. I know some people are like, well, I do it because um, for growth, it means that they have to follow me to type. And it's like, you're just shooting yourself in the foot. Because if like, if I, if I ever see a guy and I want to type in his chat, I want to just type in his chat. I don't want to have to be forced to follow him. I feel like I should just be able to say what I want. So usually what I'll do is I'll follow him and type in the chat. And then as soon as I'm done typing, I unfollow him. And I feel like most people I know do the same thing. Because I do that. And I'm sure most other people do that. Um, I really don't think it helps that much with growth. Actually, I think it hurts your growth. Um, I think the main reason you'd have that is if you have frequent like hate hate rates. Don't even talk in the chat. <laughs> well, it's only is good for streamers with higher viewership, not low. Yeah, absolutely. If you're just trying to, it's you, if you're just kind of trying to like manage the the people talking, and there's like too many people talking, you can have slow mode or followers only. Yeah, that's just to keep random bots from coming in and like doing dumb shit. Um, but I I don't really like having barriers in between myself and the viewer or the audience. I feel like. Being able to just talk whenever you want and be able to interact. Like, that's why I have my ad set up in the way that I do is to prevent pre-rolls from fucking you guys up. Because that's cringe. You know what I mean? Just gets in the way. But we're back in the game, baby. On the dot, too. So we gotta go to Dr. Alphys' house. That's the last thing we gotta do. Care for a ride? Yes, please. Where will we go today, Hotland? Then we're off. It's a good thing that uh, Toby put in this box. This this uh, this boat. I mean, uh, what the fuck, box? Why don't you sing with me, Tra La La? <clears throat> did you guys see that Toby Fox apparently um did a had a cameo, uh in We Baby Bears? Did you guys see that? I know Garlic fucking saw it because I literally sent them the video. Uh, but pretend like you, you're acting surprised. I'm gonna go to her house. Hello? Alphys? Hang on. It's a note from Alphys. Read it? Well, if she didn't want us to read it, she would put it out like this. It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey. Thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But, as difficult as it, as it is to say this... Dupish! Welcome back to the stream, man. You guys alone can't magically make my, my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. 
I'm gonna start doing that now. I wanna be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you wanna know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You will at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. Damn, I thought this was the door. <laughs> Fine. What the fuck? I thought this was a fucking bathroom. My Latin. Welcome to the stream, gamer. <laughs> we're currently uh, on the uh, route for the pacifism run, and we're basically at the end of the game. We're just kind of getting some... Warning, warning! Oh, shit. Tether stability lost. Altitude dropping. <laughs> Carol, like, fucking scared. He goes, here we go. <laughs> but yeah, we're currently wrapping up some loose ends. And I'm, I'm all, it's all very, uh, I'm blind right now. More or less. That's a big nightmare for people. Elevators dropping. Oh my god. Where? There's gotta be a fucking light switch in here somewhere. It's really dark. Hang on. Oh, hang on. Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. <clears throat> so to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a soul's monster's soul last. Entry number five. I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. The will to keep living, the resolve to change fate. Let's call this power determination. So we're at number five. One, two, three, four. Wait. One, two, three, four. We skipped one. This was entry number three. Wait. We went straight to number five. Entry number two. This is entry number one. Okay, let's see here. There's a one on the far right. Now it's at number five, right? Number five. Where's number four? Something's happened. Oh, God. Help us, what have you fucking done? It's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Elevator lost power entered the center door. That's all you could read. Power room. Yeah, why not? Yeah, I'll probably eat those. They're probably good for you. The true laboratory. I'm gonna go on the right path. I like right. Is it- wait, did it actually say chisps? Misspelled. This is number four. Number six. Asgore asked everyone outside the city for monsters that had fallen down. 
Their bodies came in today. They're still comatose, and soon they'll all turn to dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish, then freedom might be closer than we all thought. Number nine. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? Some kind of operating table. It's sticky. Uh. It's some kind of <coughs> dust in the air. cell phone you can hear voices through the receiver come join the fun they say hum oh uh, i think we should join the fun you'll be with us shortly lorem ipsum Uh, refuse. Oh, well. Hmm. I'd like to know what, uh, seems like it doesn't care anymore. Uh, there we go. There's a red key lying in the sink. You took it and put it in your keychain. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Drain dropped it. That's all you could read. Oh, so it's a hint. So they dropped the key down the drain. Alright, time to go back. Might as well save over here. We got the red one. That opens now. Maybe this is number four. Number 12. Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I'll just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. Number 13. One of the bodies opened its eyes. That's not good. It's an empty dog food bowl. Yeah, I gotta say, Alphys, I think you kind of fucked up. It's a bed. Not the kind of... Seems like a comfy bed. You could probably climb into it if you were to the left of it. Sure. Yeah, I'd love to lie down. You know, I've had a hard day. I've had a long day. I think it's time I... Have some, take some shut eye, you know what I mean? You know, I was right. This was a really comfy bed. This is a really. It's a very nice, nice. Oh. Huh. <laughs> oh, how nice of them. <laughs> Hang on, hang on. If I get out, will it... <clears throat> Let me try again. Just gonna lie down. <laughs> so bad. 
for a moment that briefly goes. Everyone has, that had fallen down has woken up. They're all walking around and talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. He's very timid. Yeah, he's a little timid, he's a little, little guy. Entry number 15, seems like this research was a dead end, but at least we got a happy ending out of it. Sent the souls back to Asgore, returned the vessel to his garden. Called all the families and told them they're, everyone's alive. I'll send everyone back tomorrow, smiley face. Entry number 16. No, 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 no! <laughs> Jeez, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I imagine that's exactly what she sounded like. Uh, hello? Ha! Oh, it was nothing. See, guys? You guys were all panicking. You guys were all scared. There's nothing. Nothing in the... It was nothing. All along. Huh? I thought that was a weird place to put a safe point. Smells like sweet lemons. Wait, lemon bread. Hum. Uh, hum. You hum a familiar tune. Their body shakes. Oh, that's not good at all. Okay, let's, um, scream. You screamed out, but nobody came. Do you think I'm pretty? Yes. Truly. A sight to behold. Uh, let's, um... Call. Okay. But nobody came. Oh my god. Okay, uh, let's flex then. Do you think I'm pretty? Apparently not. <laughs> Apparently not. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything. Everything's gonna be fine. We're just having one of these moments again. No, it is. I can imagine that Alpha's probably had some trouble getting rid of all the bodies under sheets. That's all you can read. I gotta get a yellow one. They seem to be labeled in a specific order. Will you watch one? Um, sure. I really don't know if I want to watch them in order. Gory, wake up. Hmm? What is it, dear? Uh, and why do I, you have that video camera? I want to get your reaction. Gory, dearest, what is my favorite vegetable? Hmm. Carrots, right? No, no, no. My favorite vegetable is... Get it? Go back to bed, dear. No, no, not yet. He, he, he. Now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Uh, I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be... Ho, ho, ho. You sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be... Well, I am going to bed. 
I was gonna say this is Toriel and, and fucking I could you could you can tell. I'm just teasing. Good night, dear. Perhaps it's too dark in here for the video to come out. I I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that. I don't really care that much about the inner lore. Especially sitting through every piece of dialogue there. I've been researching humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. This is in the way. That's number four. Oh, shit. Well, it's good that we now know that that's what happened before she figured out how to do it. Oh, wait, so presumably, if that's number four, then she figured out how to do it. She figured out how to do it on four, and then five, she's like, I've done it. Uh, unhug. Welcome to my special hell. Okay, um, cry. That's what they all say. That one is a little fucky. Th those two were a little bullshit. Um, I'm gonna just keep humming. Little dumb, that one. Let's, uh, let's eat some instant, uh, uh Starfate. We have a lot. Do you think I'm freaky? You know what this music reminds me of? LSD Dream Emulator. Um, let's, uh, let's, uh, uh, call Flex. I've felt this before. I ran. Oh, hang on. We did it. We can finally get rid of this fucker. All right. Uh, extraction machine status inactive. Uh, do you think it's... Should I bother reading through all that dialogue in those tapes? Because that's a lot of dialogue I'd have to get. Well, this isn't so good. You can if you want. Is it important? Like, can I safely ignore it and, like, no, no consequences? Or will I, like, miss out on a huge part of the- part of the dial- uh, shit. I don't think so. It's good. Entry number seven. We'll need a vessel to wield the monster's souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters. Because a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then... What about something that's neither human nor monster? Number 10. Experiments in the vessels are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the control cases. Whatever, they're a hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick to you and won't let go. Huh! Oh! Huh! Oh. That's... That's definitely not good. Pick on. God, I don't remember what these fuckers... I think... I think this one was a... No, this guy was a mystify. Something mysterious. Huh? Huh? What? Wh wh huh? <laughs> huh? Huh? 
that was uh, a little um, uh, worrying. Gotta say, pray. Just conscious. Ah, it's multiple. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, uh, I don't like this battle at all. Ah, it seems like it's multiple, like, fused together. Uh, let's pick on them, too. Let's remember something. Someone finally gets it. Oh my god. Star fits are very expensive, okay? I think it's time I go back and save. To get my health back. Instead of having to spend all my money or I'll get rid of all my star fits. There we go. We got it, baby. I'm checking something. Don't think the starfish don't grow on trees, now do they? There's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Cold. That's all you can read. A blue colored slot. Cold. What is cold? Okay, so there's probably something else somewhere else. Let's uh, let's go back this way. Oh, there's the cold. Entry number eleven. Now that Metatons made it big, he never talks to me anymore, except to ask when I'm going to finish his body. I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. Then we'll never be friends ever again. Not to mention every time I try to work on it, I just get really sweaty. There's a switch on the wall. Press it? Yes. That sounds really shitty. Oh! Oh no! Hey, doggy! I think it's time we turn this back off! <laughs> hey, doggy! Hey there, you wanna play fetch? Back in. <laughs> oh. Where's the face? There's the face. Oh, good. Uh, let's play. Uh, actually, I'll ignore you for now. Oh. Oh no. Okay, yeah, I mean, let's, let's play. Never mind. Okay, let's, I'll beckon you again. Nothing else happens. Oh my god. Ooh, uh, that one got really close. Okay. I don't really know how to commentate on this. This is fucking weird. It calms down. It rests, it rests quietly on your lap for a moment. Oh, goody. Only it shoots away and crawls wildly on the walls. This is really fucked up. <laughs> I'm also really bad at doing the 
I know these are called bullet hells, but I'm really bad at bullet hells from what I've discovered. All right, let's try again. This time we got it. I wonder if that's supposed to be a dog. I think it is supposed to be a dog or multiple dogs. Um, based on the fact that it's a dog and it also has crosses, like those little, you know, like shoot it out of its face. I think it's, it's a dog and a different creature. Uh, back in. Like, look, it's got crosses. And I know there's another creature. There's another care. There's another enemy, I guess, enemy. Ah, oh, pet. It's probably fine. Ow. That's the first time I got hit by that one. Uh, let's play! Brings it back to you. Proudly? Very tired means it's dripping amorphous body onto you. I don't like... Th this thing's kind of fucked up. Does the black on white also have dog-shaped silhouettes? That's a good point. I all... Well, they look more like cats. Um, let's play some more or pet. It's nice to generate a stage one happiness froth. What? Um, um. Who, uh, who's a good boy? Feelers rotate quickly. Nothing has happened. Oh my god. I don't like the sounds this thing's making. Play some more. I mean, uh, maybe pet some more. Hey, look. You were right. There's dogs. You were right. It was five dogs in a trench coat. <laughs> There's just five dogs in a trench coat, guys. Why are you guys afraid? Five dog doggers in a trenchy. Alright, I already took care of this guy. Do I have the blue some kind of switch. I don't have the, the blue co the blue uh key. You were right. This is definitely enough um time. Also, is this the way the game wanted me to go? Like you I know you said yesterday, Garlic, um that if I needed any hints as to where to go, it seems pretty obvious where I was supposed to go. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Entry number 19. The families keep calling me to ask when everyone is coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. Entry number 20. Left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. One about this cute teacup he found that looks like me. Hey, Paul Mango, welcome back to the stream, man. What's up, my jaggedy friend? I haven't slept since last stream. That, ooh. Mm. Thanks, Asker. Spent all my time at the garbage dump. Now it's my element. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Refrigerator. Seems to contain samples of some kind. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Oh, I knew it. Oh.
That's kind of fucked up. Well, at least I can recognize some of them. There's the two carrots on the left and the right. And then it's the... I'll, I'll tell it a few... I'll, I'll laugh. I'll, 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 t I'll, I'll joke. The bad pun about snow. Haha, ha, I rem I remember... Oh my god, the fucking music is a little fucked up. Haha, th thank you. The fucking music, like, not really sure if it should start. Oh, that's just fucking sad. That's actually just fucking sad. It, like, the music couldn't even do it. They couldn't even fight back. She can't even fight. Yeah, it's bad, dude. And by that, I mean... Bro, that thing looks and acts like my younger brother. And by that, I mean dead to me. Oh, fuck. Dude, I thought he just dropped a bombshell on me. Also, adds to me soon. Uh, yeah, I thought you were, you were about to just tell me. <laughs> Man. No, on the ground, you can't make it all out. Kurt! That's all you could be. Now, this seems a little backtracky. I gotta be real. Uh, because I'm noticing you have to go back and forth, and there's a lot of walking. Um... Personally... Personally. Personally. I find backtracking and padding like this a little not great, but... I mean, hey, what can you do? Blue key fits in perfectly in the slime. Alright, now where? There's a curtain somewhere. Where's the curtain? Where's the curtain? Hmm. That is the question that's on my mind. What's orange and tastes like red paint? Uh, what? Is it orange paint? <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. So it looks like to me that red is on the left, blue is on the right, so if I want to find the yellow one, the next one is going to be at the bottom. It's going to be on the right again. Somehow there's a yellow one somewhere to the left. I'm about to fucking sneeze. Where am I supposed to go? Audio crackling is a little odd. I made some bomb ass sandwiches before I joined. Oh, heck yeah. What you got in those sandwiches, man? What you got in the sandwiches? It's an empty bathtub. I took some mustard and I slammed it on the bread. You better not say that that's it. There better be more. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Under sheets. So you can read. Smoked ham. Put that on the top. Let's roll back though. What kind of, what kind of mustard are we talking about? And I pulled out the cheese. Okay, okay. The beds. Yeah, I know it's on the beds, Garlic. Thank you.
You didn't check them all. I was gonna check the beds. I just wanted to see if I missed anything. I'm checking the beds now, but not because you told me to check the beds, but because I was gonna do that anyway. Something under the sheets. Check it out. Yes, please. Then I put some herb salt and black pepper. You fucking wrote... No, you... I messed up. How? Okay. <clears throat> M and S are on opposite sides of the keyboard. <laughs> Maybe he was trying to write cuz um... <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm gonna guess he forgot the S's. I'm gonna guess that's what happened. <laughs> the Automod did not catch that. I can't believe it. It'll catch a lot of things, but it won't catch that. <laughs> It's uh here. There it is, yeah. Click the yellow key fits perfectly into the slot. And I took some curry powder curry powder and oregano. Then I threw that shit in the oven. Oh fuck yeah. Actually, I might just take this idea. Oh, I already had the green key. The whole time. Um, I might just fucking yoink this shit and make it. Myself. That sounds really good. I do not remember you having a green key. Neither did I. Maybe I, maybe I picked up the green key at the beginning. Maybe I like picked it up really far away. That's your favorite midnight snack. That's a that's a big meal to have as a midnight snack. What kind of bread? Actually, hang on. What kind of bread was it? And what kind of mustard? Because that's an important thing. Seems to be turned off. Seems to be turned off. Seems like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on. Yes. I think I made a terrible decision. It was roast and toast bread. Oh, heck yeah. Hey, stop! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I think they smelled the potato chips you had and... Anyways. Oh my fucking god. The power went out and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you. But I appreciate that you came up here. I came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. That's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something. Cowardly. What's oh, Swedish? It reminds me of, um... Oh God, I'm gonna I'm gonna sound like really fucking ignorant if I say this. Uh, is Hagelslag Swedish? I think that's what it's called. Let me let me double check. Or is that Dutch? Ah, uh, say that again. Oh God. Oh God, he's. <laughs> Please don't make me do this. 
Uh, it's in the Netherlands, apparently, according to my Google machine. Uh, Hagelslag. Didn't hear what you said. Is that... No, it's Dutch. You said it too fast. Yeah, because I'm cowardly. It's Dutch. It's just fucking chocolate sprinkles. You put them on, you put it on toast. It's fucking good. As you probably know, Hasgo asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. The experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take those concentrations of determination. Oh, that weird fairy bread thing. God. <laughs> well. <sighs> yeah, I only put sprinkles on cake and ice cream. That's a good point. Their bodies started to melt and lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted together into... Those... Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. Couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much everyone was asking me. I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing everything I'd done so far had been such a horrific failure. But now, well, now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm gonna tell everyone what I've done. It's gonna be hard. Being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again. But knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Huh. Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgo yet because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. Bro, how ch ain't she arrested yet? They don't... Asgo doesn't know. He doesn't know. How would he know? A flower in the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder. What happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Entry number 18. The flower is gone. How the fuck can three words have that much impact? <laughs> In any other context. In any other context. It's a voice you have never heard before. Jaga, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Jaga. See you soon. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that doesn't seem good. That doesn't seem good at all. I just, uh, despite you, I'm going to watch one of your old streams later. What my, like, one of my really, really old ones. One of my legacy ones from, like, years, like, like a year ago. Mr. Jaga Live. <laughs> Goddamn. That would be a fucking, <clears throat> that'd be kind of interesting to kind of go through some like old fucking Jaga content. Maybe like do a stream where we watch an old VOD and comment on how much I've improved. Um, 
Hopefully. Hopefully I've improved. God, can you imagine? Um, another thing as well, though. I had an idea for a stream. And I don't know if I'd ever do this because I kind of like not showing my face. And I kind of not like having a camera uh, pointing at random shit. But here's the thought. Here's the idea. Um, I watched a video about building like a custom made keyboard. Like when it, making one of those really, really custom ones. So instead of buying a mechanical keyboard um, off the shelf, I would buy all the switches. I'd buy like a bunch of like different colors, like maybe cherry MX reds and blues and browns and shit. And we would sit down, we'd build one together as a stream and set up some microphones to look all nice and pretty uh, or to make it sound all nice and pretty uh, so you guys can hear the keyboard as it was intended um, as it would sound and then we just sit down we just build a keyboard and then maybe we build a second one I could give that one away should we do that in the last stream of the grindathon look back in your old VODs god no can you imagine my ch my chat just said audios and disappeared or audios. It came back when I refreshed, but what happened? Uh, we we just had a little conversation, bro. That seems like a stupid way to waste some time. Let's fucking do it. Hey, there are motherfuckers that love the sound of like those super custom made keyboards. Okay, where is the save point? Let's fucking do it. Yeah, fuck yeah, baby. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're so enthusiastic. All right. All right, guys. See you soon. <laughs> Let's do this. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. I use Opera Browser, I can literally cross what sound I want playing when I press the keys. Or choose what sound. What a fuck. Why does it say cross? Time to fight Ascore. Ascore! <laughs> Just do what you must. Continue. Alright, <clears throat> let's see what I can do. I think it'd be kind of cool, though, to get some nice mics up. Maybe a little uh, fold-out table, and we build a keyboard, and then maybe we build a few. And then we give away one. It's made up mode every time I press the button. Cringe. It's funny for, like, 50 minutes. That's the kind of thing I would do on a piano. That my mom walked in. It's way funnier on a piano because it adjusts the pitch depending on the notes. So you can play musical like chords. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. What? Huh? Wait, I thought I was gonna fight him. I like adjusted my volume. Uh, I adjusted my volume to fucking... Because I thought we were gonna fight. Oh god. Did the fucking... Wait. Wait. Was this Flowey's plan? Was that- was this his plan? Like, there's no way she just fucking decided to up and leave on her own Cause fucking Papyrus is like, yeah, there's a flower that told me to go- Like, he's been talking to the flower. Sans fucking said there's a flower. Right. Sans fu uh, said that there was a flower talking to Papyrus. This chick just fucking showed up out of nowhere, right? So it's it's probably Flowey's been talking to her. 
He also was the one that was randomly just decided, hey, you want a better ending? You want a good ending, bro? You should, you should go and talk to all your friends. That way they all show up. What a miserable creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel. Your friend and guardian. At first I thought I would let you make your journey alone. But I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been treacherous. And ultimately it would be it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would take the life of another person. You would have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized I cannot allow that. It was not right to sacrifice someone simply, simply to let someone else leave. Someone leave here. But have you seen Smash Bits team in old Undertale animation? Maybe. Uh, probably, maybe. I watched a lot of gameplay back when the game first came out, but I, I didn't really get very heavy into the whole community animation. Is that not what I have been trying to prevent this whole time? So for now, let us su suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Came back. Do not tore me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul. Taken six souls from the human, then come back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair. Because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Really? You're right. I'm a miserable creature. But do you think we can at least be friends again? You got fucking... You got fucking... Friend zone, but your own goddamn wife, dude. But your own wife. Thank God it wasn't, I didn't do this yesterday because that was Father's Day. Man, would that guy be fucking crying. More like Toto Africa. It's a common, uh, comedy thing if Undertale was realistic. Am I right, lad, or am I right? You are right, lad. <laughs> Asgore. Asgore, human! Nobody fight each other! Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll beat all of you up! Hello, I'm Toriel. Never. Your father's never home on Father's Day. Damn. Are you the human's friend? Or his birthday? It was nice to meet you. Is he at the bar? Yeah, nice to meet you too. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. Hey, nobody hurt each other. Oh, are you another friend? I'm Toriel, hello. Hi. There's two of them. Hey, nobody fight each other. If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced. To ask on down for help. Hello? Oh, hello, your majesty. Oops. Hey, human. Did Asgore shave and uh, clone himself? Hey, guys, what's up? Bad voice. Hello, I think we may have, uh, no, we know, we know each other. Uh, hey, I recognize your voice, too. I'm Toria. So nice to meet you. The name's Sam. And, uh, Sam. Oh, wait, then this must be your brother. No, he's at work. He works at the sea. He's gone for like a few weeks to a month. Damn. Greetings, Papyrus. It was so nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowee! I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am. This is the best day of my life. Hey, Papyrus. What's a skeleton tile's roof with? I don't even want to fucking read this, this next line. <sighs> Shit. It's 
No proof roof tiles? No silly. Skeleton tiles is roof with. But you see the way Toriel blushes when talking to Sans? Change my mind, this is the worst day of my life, the fucking eyes. Come on, Asgore, it's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. I was totally right about that fish thing. Sometimes you've just gotta, uh, stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, just get to know a really cute fish. It's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh my god! Will you two just smooch already? The audience is dying from some romantic action. Hey, shut up, man. The nerve of that guy. Right, Alps? Uh, Alps? No, he's right. Let's do it. Bunch of question marks. Can't even pronounce it. Well, uh, I guess if you want it, then don't hold anything back. That is... That is... <laughs> They've never kissed before. <laughs> she just friends, friend zoned her husband. And now she want to bone the bone man. <laughs> Not a bone of the human. Yeah, guys. Shield your eyes. Sorry, I got a little carried away there. By the way, this is all happening in the battle screen. We're currently... Still actively in fight or flight, I have my hand on my gun. The second anybody makes a sudden move, I'm blowing this whole place. Did I say gun? I meant dead man switch. <laughs> I meant a bomb. From the... Where do I make... Where do they make bombs? Eh, whatever. <laughs> my child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you've made, I think, I think you'll be happy here. Hey, that reminds me, Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her, uh, wait, 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 I got here before you, how did you know to call everybody? Let's just say a tiny flower helped me. If I remember correctly, it's the pie factory. It's a pie. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. I just couldn't remember where they make bombs. Who would have known they make them at the pie factories? A tiny... flower? I fucking called it. I fucking called it! The pom the bomb is a pie. You idiots. While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls. And now but not only are those under my power, but all of your friends' souls are gonna be mine too. <laughs> and you know what that the best part is? It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you. All the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they couldn't have come here. And now with their souls and humans together, I will achieve my true form. <laughs> huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game if you win he literally does air quotes he does air quotes right in front of us with his pedals you won't want to play with me anymore what would i do then this game between us will never end i'll hold victory in front of you just with your reach and then tear it away just before you grasp it over and over and over <laughs> Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring you your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied, but that won't happen. You won't. 
I'll keep you here no matter what. Bro, how is Sam's losing? Hey, hang on. Even if it means killing you one million times. Ow! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. <laughs> it's gonna take a lot more than that to kill me! What? Sam's is the easy easiest enemy, 1 HP. <laughs> You're right. Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, he will always be there to protect you. Man, thanks for the health, pal. That's right, human. You can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you. As long as he doesn't dodge, it's easy. Jagger remembers to BPD. I don't know. Ah, oh, fuck. Um. Um. A human, you got past me. You can do anything. So don't worry. We're with you all the way. What's funny is I've beat this guy, but I've beat... I've beat fucking Flowey before. This isn't going to be a problem. You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on. We just got nothing on you. And then Asgore's is kind of like there. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him. Thanks, Alphys. Also, I just found out what Alphys's attack was. Block parry dodge. Don't worry, I'll beat this first time. This guy's got nothing on me. It's, I'm not like Strawberry. <laughs> I'm not like Kaylee. I'll beat him first try. Watch. Somehow I know you can do it. Human for the future of human, humans and monsters. You have to stay determined. You got this. You can do it. You got this. Ribbit. No. Unbelievable. This can't be happening. You, you. He's gonna say idiot. I can't believe you're so stupid. I love your souls of mine. The game's gonna fucking shut. Watch. Who the fuck is that? The rainbow goat dead son. Oh, goody. Finally. Here's the problem, though. We're at the halfway point of the stream. <laughs> so you're just going to have to wait a few more minutes. <laughs> you guys are just going to have to wait a few minutes while I go uh, take a quick break here. And then I'll be back in just a few minutes. Uh, yes, I timed this out exactly. Uh, to do exactly this. Uh, I knew... I knew that something was gonna happen any second now. Um... So I'm gonna be right back. <laughs> You're just gonna have to be content with being blue-balled <laughs> for two minutes. I'll see you guys in a little bit.
Yeah, my mom wants to emergency. Fucking piece of shit. Hey, well, you stayed here, didn't you? <laughs> it worked. Also, I just remembered. So, <clears throat> you know how Flowey said the word stupid? I was thinking, oh, they probably, like, the, 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 they wanted it to be E for everybody, right? They wanted it to be, like, E for everybody. To be, like, fa uh, family friendly. And here's the funny thing. Because they're trying to, like, shy away from swearing. I remembered that I had a teacher in high school. And I used the word stu stupid, stupidity. Once, and she told me to watch my language. Think about that. Think about that. I was so tired of being a flower. Howdy! Jaga, are you there? Was she off of her meds? No, she was just kind of a bitch of a teacher. It's me, your best friend. Oh no. Asriel Dreamer. It's the end. Well. I guess the only thing we can really do is hope. <laughs> right? I know the music's gonna fucking get loud here in a second. Oh! Yep, yep, it definitely got a little louder. That's why I mixed the volume for the boss battle, because it's always the loudest. <clears throat> Alright, let's hope. You held on to your hopes. You reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. First time. Watch. Good thing I got all those star feats, by the way. I'll tell you right now, you will notice why I'm not sure if he's gay or just on shrooms. Um, why do you think he's gay? Bitrate dies. Um, I'm looking at the stream and I'm looking at my screen. It looks the same. Uh, it actually is just a blocky mess. So don't worry, you're not missing much. Unless, let me actually, let me get a little closer here. Nope, that's how it looks. <laughs> I said you will notice. Okay. Uh, let's uh, hit him with a dream. Think about why you're here now. Uh, you have no answers. I feel the empty space in your inventory getting smaller and smaller. You know, <laughs> I don't care about destroying this world anymore. What the fuck? Okay. I'm starting to notice some problems. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. What? Shit. What the fuck? You tripping balls at a rave right now? I'm not even here right now. All your progress and everyone's memories, I'll bring them all back to zero. Wow, I think I just got hit by every single one of those. Then we can do everything all over again. We just play, we'll just keep playing forever. Huh. You spelling out Krill, aren't you? But it refused. Look, I didn't die, okay? I didn't die. C 
girl issue. <laughs> oh, this one's easy. That one's fine. Charges Shocker Breaker. Dream. I technically, canonically, didn't die. So I'm fine, actually. I'm just gonna keep clicking between hope and dream. I don't think there's any reason to, to kinda go between the two here. I don't think there's a <clears throat> strategy between the two. And you know what the best part of all this is? You'll do it. What the fuck? What the fuck? You shot me with rainbow, bro. Dream about... <laughs> don't say that. Don't... <laughs> And then you'll lose to me again. It's like being puppeted. It's weird. Something wrong with him. He's like a marionette. And again. Wow, my health is really low. It's a good thing I got these chips. L last dream. What the fuck? And again. Wow. Here's the rainbow profanity taboo violated. <laughs> Galactica blazing. Because you want a happy ending. This one's gonna be easy. I'm not gonna take a single bit of point of damage during this whole thing. But I'm fine. Look guys, I'm fine. You know what's funny? This is actually harder than fucking the actual flowey fight. This is harder than the actual fucking flowey fight. What the fuck? Stop writing- Stop spamming Krill issue. If you're gonna write Krill issue, do it in a single message, please. Oh my god. It's a good thing I'm indestructible, right? Ha ha ha. That was really bad. Uh, could you stop spamming the, the individual letters, please? Uh, dude, come on. Stop. Like, actually stop. I'm gonna have to time me out if you keep doing it. Like, it's funny, but... Just don't, don't overdo it. Because you love your friends. Huh. Shit. It's getting a little faster, isn't he? What? Oh, I, he missed. It's alright. Yeah, no problem, man. Just because I, I remember last time we uh you you spammed the fucking rubber room thing on the ducks. Just uh just be careful with it, yeah. Because you never give up. What the fuck? I can't figure out exactly how to deal with that one. I got it the first time around and then it just didn't work out. Is it actually a blocky mess? Like, can you, can you see what's going on with this one? Please don't. <laughs> crazy, I was crazy once. Please don't. Shh. 
shit, he got me. You can see what's happening. That's good. It's very good. But the background elements are like 140p. That's how it is in the game though, canonically. That's what Chris sees. <laughs> I just got it. annihilated, okay. Yeah, I'm looking at the 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 quote unquote 144p. Um <laughs> but yeah, that's definitely what it looks like. Like these ones are the one the the attacks that I'm like worried about with all the moving things. The VA channel it's gonna look fantastic. Here, maybe a little questionable. Last few streams, we actually haven't had a lot of growth. Doesn't look as crisp as I remember. That's a good point. Honestly, yeah, I'm looking at it. Yeah, that is really bad. That is that is not what it looks like. It's now finally starting to show its crust. What the? It's a good thing I got my wish. My dream. It's not delicious. The determination, the power that let you get this far. It's going to be your downfall. Wow. You're a streamer. You don't grow as a person. That's a good point. That's a very good point. That was probably how Leafy is here got to the... What the fuck? It's probably how Leafy is here got to where they were now. Sorry, I'm uh, having some... There's no hell, so I'm not really... Sure. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way? Well, you really are something special, but don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my true power. See that what good determination is against this. It becomes fucking wide. Oh. <coughs> oh no. I I need help. Can I move your body? Ah, behold my true power. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, thank God. Dude, I thought his design was way cool on the other one. This one's like, gets really fucked up for us. Yeah, I suppose, yeah. I can feel every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life will end here in a world where no one remembers you. The whole world is ending. Uh, I actually can't use anything but act. I can't even use an item. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. I was... Dude. Dude. I don't know, there's like no way to dodge these attacks. I'm not stupid. Like there's no holes to hide in. Struggling to try to reach your save file, nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file, nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But maybe with what little power you have, you can save something else. We can save him! Oh. We should save... Um...
Uh, hmm. Toriel. I'm just, I'm not going to play favorites. I'm just going to go uh, uh, chronologically. Uh, my favorites, I mean, I uh, reached out to Asriel's soul and called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depth of Azriel's soul, something resonating. The lost soul. Hug. Something about this is so familiar to her. This is for your own good. Forgive me for this. This is an easy one. Not even a problem. Uh, let's give him a hug. This is how you heal. You hug the lost soul. It seems like this ag his aggression is slowly melting away. It's a good thing I already know how to fight these guys, right? Um, prefer What's your preference? To the lost soul, you prefer cinnamon instead of butterscotch. Somehow, she faintly recalls hearing this before. You, we got this, boy. We got this. You refuse to fight the lost soul. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. Oh, heck yeah. I fucking... I, I just... I pull out a gun. Uh, let's go, go. Oh shit, I didn't do chronologically. Oh well, whatever. Something's resonating. Um, let's tell you a really bad joke. He seems to hate it, but the other lost soul seems to like it. Just give it up, I do. Oh shit. Not this one, please, dude. I'm so glad it's an easy one. I was never good at the blow. Puzzles. You have the lost soul for help with the puzzle. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. <laughs> you can see I forgot what the fuck the blue ones mean. You'll never see him again. Krill issue. Stop it! <laughs> Lost soul, you insult them. Suddenly, its memories are flooding back, seeing how nicely you treated its brother the lot other. <laughs> I didn't even care about the other guy. This is the min maxing. All right, let's go ahead and get uh, Alphas. Something's resonating. Oh, God. Uh, encourage. Uh, you tell the lost soul that you'll continue to support her. Something about the way you said that is familiar to her. You hate me, don't you? Jesus Christ, they're still throwing things. Gotta keep on lying. So this thing telling me to replace the word problem with opportunity. Ugh, suddenly the memories are flooding back. No, that's not true. My fans like me and I like you too. That's of Azriel's soul. Something is resonating. Lost soul appeared. Oh god, it's fucking green. Fake hit. Uh, which means I have a very severe drinking opportunity. Yay! You tap the lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight is familiar. All humans will die. So I, I thought my screen just rotated there briefly. That was weird. 
You're a real enemy. I've gotten good, can you tell? Clash. She recognizes your fighting spirit. Suddenly, memories are flooding back. Some humans okay, I guess. Someone else. Strangely, as your friends remember you, something else begins res began resonating within the soul. Stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? Suddenly, you realize. Reach out and call their name. Burger Pants! <laughs> what are you doing? Feel your friend's soul resonating within Azrael. What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? I don't need anybody. I have bombs! You missed, idiot. Stop it, get away from me. You hear me? I'll tell you a bot. A little weak there, pal. These are kind of a shitty attack. How's the stream going? It's going all right, man. We're at the end of the game. <laughs> Press this such a bitch ass. Got fucking flagged by the auto mod. Jaga, do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? Can't bug Amy. What a shit shot. I'm doing this because you're special, Jaga. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. No. That's not just it. Uh, I'm doing this because I care about you, Jaga. I don't care about mo I care about you more than anybody else. He's just saying these things, Chad. Don't listen to him. Don't listen to his lies. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. But you better fucking start hitting me, dude. Come on. So please, stop doing this. And just... Let me win. Point nine. Point five. Point one. Point oh one. Point oh oh one. Oh 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 one. Oh 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 oh. Oh, oh fire! I can't say. I refuse to die. Also, if I die, then I shit my fucking pants right in front of everybody. I look really fucking, I look like a bitch. I just had Taco Bell and I'm holding it in right now. I'm letting you do your monologue. But dude, I really gotta go to the bathroom. Can we take like five minutes right now? <laughs> you already do. Damn it. Don't worry. I already look like a fucking idiot. Jaga. I'm so alone. And the aim assist in the video game doesn't account for player velocity. His face is becoming much brighter than the rest of him. Or rather, the rest of him is becoming much darker. I'm so afraid, Jaga. Jaga. I... I...
You can tell he's a kid because he's got a striped shirt. <clears throat> I'm just so sorry. He's like, <laughs> he's like sniffling. I can't. I, I actually have like no nothing in my nostrils right out there. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Jacka? Coughing in tabs. Bro's got an ugly ass sweater. The best time to wear a striped sweater is all the time. <laughs> One with turtle neck. Or whatever the fuck the lyrics were. I know. You're not actually Jaga, I you? Who's been gone for a long time. Uh, why? What is your name? Frisk. <laughs> That's a nice name. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As if I were, I was soulless. I like the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside of me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other person, mo monsters as well. Uh, Frisk is a, is a Swedish, in, uh, Frisk in Swedish means not sick. Uh, Frisk also means to pat down, I think. To search somebody uh, for uh, contraband, like bombs and pies. <laughs> they all care about each other so much, and they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Pirates, Sands, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all re- I'll really love him. <laughs> Frisk, I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. Something, something. Live lobster in a sealed plastic container. Well, I forgive you. What? Why? Huh? Run that by me again? What did you say? Did you say you forgive me? I could sell this compassion for online for money. If you get the joke, you win a free pie. Oh, fuck yeah. Fresh come on. <laughs> You're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire. With everyone's power, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. Wait, he's gonna fucking... He's gonna break the fucking barrier and then he's gonna return it. He's gonna sacrifice himself, dude. Also, wait a second. There was the barrier. Chat. That's a lot of human souls. He was supposed to be godlike or just a god. And you're telling me I... Man. Man, I must be really strong. Frisk. They have to go now. fuck I do I still don't forgive him dude don't worry he'll he, he he'll he give me he'll give he's a furry that's fair <laughs> can't be trusted. um the problem with um that is that furries on uh they they control most things IT um, they probably are the ones responsible for selling your data in particular. 
Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower, I'll stop being myself, I'll stop being able to feel love again. So Frisk, just if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people you love. <laughs> I don't want to let go. He won't feel love, but he will gain lots of love. So this guy's like evil, right? Does that mean that like the minions would like he would lead the minions? Would he, would he, like, the, canonically minions, um, deal with the most evil people in history, so that should include Flowey the Flower. I think it's a perfect match, because minions are yellow, and so is Flowey. Yeah. You're gonna do a great job, okay? Only if he killed crew. Honestly, I, I think he'd make fucking... I think it'd be no problem for him. He'd fucking make easy work at a group. No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? It ain't no way he'll beat Papa Gru. No, he'll beat him. He's fine. Well, time's running out. Goodbye. By the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? Thought he was going to return the dust. Frisk. This is all just a bad dream. Please. Wake up. Also, Flowey is, is why I will always be slightly racist to count people. <laughs> Jesus. Chances are, uh, they will see round yellow object and attempt to eat it. It's a good point because they also really like bananas. And farts. Oh, wait, thank goodness. They were so worried. It felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Made papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry. I don't cry. I just caught something in my eye. What did you catch? Tears. No, no. The important part is that Frisk is all right. Yeah, Frisk. Why not drink tea? It'll make you feel better. How about we give them space first? They must be very exhausted. catch needles with my eyes. Ouch. From what? I am not certain. First, we do not remember exactly what happened. There was a flower, and then everything went white. But now the barrier is gone. When you are ready, we will return to the surface. It seems the door is to the east. It will lead us there now. Before then, perhaps you might want to take a walk. You can say goodbye to all your wonderful friends. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Chat, is it fucked up if I actually just want to end the game? Because we do have like 15 minutes left. We might have some time to talk to everybody, but honestly, um, that's starting soon, by the way. I am that shit. I. Uh, I don't know, I've never really been- I don't really want to backtrack- I mean, l l let's check. How far can I backtrack? Okay, I- I thought maybe they'd make like a fast travel to get to like the place where everyone is. I actually just want to fucking finish this one. You might be able to talk to people. Oh, I- I'm sure I definitely can. Um, I just don't 
really want to. Because uh, it would take more than 15 minutes, which is more time than we have. Don't. They do not. You have to walk all around. I feel like you're lying to me. But I don't really care. You can leave here. Your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out of the, out of the underground. Wait. That's right. That's right, Jim. You can go back to the beginning if you want, but don't. I will unfollow if you do. That's a lie. Dramatic effect. <laughs> Alright, now we can go. Don't leave just yet. Hang on, hang on. Let me, let me call. I noticed you received a text from Toriel. Dear Frisk, Sends and Alphys are teaching me how to text. I am learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? Please look at this. Fantastic job. Still got the stick, baby. Fuck yeah. I turn your head to the left. It is a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? LOL, that stands for lots of laughter. Don't I'm leave ready. <laughs> this is Eriatorial. That's all for now. Maybe in the next room. You'll receive another. I don't think I will. No response. Their phone might be out of batteries. Alright, now I'm actually gonna leave. Leave now, just do it. I mean, we could probably... We could probably go get, like, something really tasty. We could get some nice cream, you know? Some delicious, scrumptious, nice cream. Leave. <laughs> okay, fine, fine, fine. I'll, I'll go, I'll go. You got everything you need. Well, hey, hang on, maybe- <laughs> I'm kidding, okay, fine, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Snowman piece. We have it, we have it. I put it in my pocket. Wait, you forgot to give Thomas the lemon. There's no character called Thomas, you're lying. <laughs> There's no lemon. You're making that up. Oh my. Isn't it beautiful? Everyone. Nobody fucking taught them not to look at suns. But you missed 53 pages of lore. Well, somebody else can read that. <laughs> wow, it's even better than on TV. Way better, better than I have uh, could have possibly imagined. Chris, you live with this? 53,000 asterisks. The sunlight is so nice and the air is so fresh. Really feel alive. Hey, Sans, what's that giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. That's the sun? Wow, we. I can't believe I'm finally meeting the sun. I could stand here and watch this for hours. It is beautiful, is it not? We should really. Think about what comes next. You notice how fucking Toriel and Asgore are still sitting on complete opposite sides? They lived in a cave. How do they survive without vitamin D? They don't need vitamin D. They're not humans. Unless there's a fucking really bad dad joke you're about to drop on me. Beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between the humans and monsters. Two of them are literally skeletons. 
may have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? Yeah. Yeah, Frisk will be the new best ambassador. And I, the Great Papyrus, will be the best mascot. I'll go make a good first impression. There he goes. Well. Does that mean Sans and Papyrus were once, uh, humans once? Um. <clears throat> um. Sans is actually an acronym. It stands for, uh, Steven after not surviving. <laughs> God, that is one of the dumbest fucking jokes that ever came out of the fucking Undertale community. <laughs> Someone's got to keep him get from getting into trouble. See you guys. Oh my god, I knew he was going to walk in a weird direction. Man, do I have to do everything. Papyrus, wait! So that's where the two of the other souls came from. Hey, Undyne, wait up! Whoops. What? What do you mean, whoops? Uh, did I do something? Well, uh, gotta go! Seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk. You came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? Uh, I got places to be. <laughs> I got, I got places to be. If I, if I choose this option, you guys won't be mad at me, right? <laughs> you guys won't get mad at me if I choose this option, right? I ain't gonna live with a fairy. Damn, leave. <laughs> It feels weird because it feels like I just met the fucking lady. It feels like I just fucking met the lady, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like... Alright. <clears throat> here's my here's my, uh, my way of dealing with this. I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm gonna hit it an unknown amount of time. I'm gonna just hit the D-pad a bunch. I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm gonna hit X. Okay. I don't even know what I chose. I see. Well, I chose the I'm busy. I hope that I am not keeping you. Frisk. See you around. Damn, Meatball Heartless. We did it, guys. We beat Undertale. Maybe in the future we can play fucking Deltarune as well. But the thing is, with Deltarune, I've definitely 100% already played it. in the beginning correction I did oh <clears throat> yeah um I um uh... oh shit and there he is in his car on the highway and what kind of bicycle is that Yeah, no, maybe, maybe in the future we could possibly play, uh, Deltarune. I actually did definitely enjoy Deltarune a lot more than I enjoyed this game, which is surprising. But, you know, when you gain experience developing games, and also when you go in completely blind, because Deltarune I went in completely blind, this game I went in more, mostly blind. More or less blind.
Now we gotta watch some if Undertale was realistic, right? Uh I'm not sure about the uh What's the word? Um not morality, um the ethics of just streaming somebody else's content. I know that it's like the meta for Twitch and like it's how you get views, but like, I don't know. I don't really agree with it. We Maybe in the future, but... Maybe in the future if I somehow... Inspired by Omo Cat. If I somehow manage to trick myself into thinking that it's like morally correct. Look at who it is. Better time by Toby. He literally fucking... Toby made a box. I also be able to hear your response because of ads. It's fine. They are okay with it. I have to go. My asynchronous classes schedule Zoom meeting is in five minutes. All right, man. If you want to lurk or whatever, um, we're going to be doing a raid here pretty shortly. But uh, good luck in the class, man. Use your imagination. God damn. It's kind of funny how many characters were made by Toby. I thought it was like a 50-50. Oh, wait, no. Fucking Deltarune, it was like a 50-50 split between Toby and, and Temi. Nobody knows who made these guys. I want you to define asynchronous. Happening at the same time. Sorry, not at the... S <clears throat> I believe so. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to remember how the fuck it's used in programming. I think, yeah, it's like, it's like creating multiple threads. We did it, guys. We did it. We beat the game. Oh no. <laughs> Did you really think that it was over? I mean, we haven't even done the special things yet. This makes sense for a tutorial to be a teacher. Yeah. She she remember she literally said she wanted to be a teacher uh, at the beginning of the game. Signed up for the class with no scheduled meetings and it was a scheduled meeting. See how many I caught. These are easy. Ah, ah, ah. All right, who's ever in the center of the screen? Daniel. I was gonna try to get Brian. I wanted Brian, dude. Some guy had a really, really long name just there. Supposed to try and make them all yellow. No, 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 no. No, no. I don't, I don't gotta touch these. I don't legally have to touch this. <laughs> Are they like the stretched name? Oh, uh, you know what? That th Those people in, in, in particular, pretty cool. The special things. These are all the backers. These are all the Kickstarters. You can see how bad I am at the game by my ability to not be able to dodge any of these and continuously make the same mistake over and over again. Is 
Sorry, I've been finished those. You fuckers. There's Daniel. Um, hmm. Daniel Turner. Spoon. Thanks to friends and family for supporting us and Undertale team. Thanks for you, the player. From the bottom of our hearts, without you all, this would have been impossible. Good night. It was a little hard in the bottom there. It's really dark. Look at him go. The end. I gotta go, uh... Up to Kern in a few hours, and I can't eat, even have my eyes sight. Uh, wait, I can't have my eyes sights uh, be affected by a lack of sleep at the wrong strength lenses. That's a good point. Uh, is this it? Is it just gonna hang here? I didn't just lose all my viewers because the game hasn't isn't technically over yet, have I? Cringe. Yeah, I think that's it. But, yeah, that was Undertale. Pretty fucking cool. Um, honestly, the, <laughs> the fact that it took, like, it was like a few fucking kilobytes to download that whole game. That's a lot of content. A lot of content for, uh... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... <clears throat> go i was gonna go find somebody to raid but i think we may have just lost all of our viewers that was fun yeah dude uh tomorrow i definitely want i might go back actually i was kind of torn between playing the last station again or the final station and uh more rain world that was fun move to a different time zone um i i don't really want to move anymore i want to watch it during the day I don't need to fucking I don't need to move to a different time zone to do that. I'm gonna refresh my page here, hang on. Yeah, we could probably I do definitely want to stream uh, a few um few streams kinda earlier on in the day, uh to, to for the European audience. But I did that a few times during the last grindathon and um the European audience didn't show up. So it was, it was like, and, and not even the regular viewers showed up because they weren't expecting me to be live at that time. So it actually hurt my viewership. But yeah, um, I think we lost all of our viewers and normally this would be the time I'd do a raid, but we can't do a raid. We don't have enough people. We could just chill for a little bit. We could just talk. <laughs> uh, what game do you guys want to see uh, in the future for, during the Granathon? Because we have a lot of games we can go over. Yeah, well, I didn't know you existed during our, your last Granathon, so don't blame me. I didn't blame you. I do think, though, that the Long Dark would be a really fucking cool game to play on stream. Possibly. I would definitely have to drop the quality of the stream, though, just to, to make it look halfway decent. That's one of them problems you got to deal with. Now, the question is, if we do raid somebody, who do we raid? I eventually want to raid Sturdy Bread back. But we can't raid him back because he hasn't been fucking luck. Um, I or I I want to hit him with a big one. It's gonna suggest something about my brain fell asleep in mid writing. What was the last time that Goron streamed? Actually, wait, 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 wait. Actually, where has Goron been? Like he's been away. Ooh, he's been gone. I need to ask like his uh, his friends to see where he's gone. He hasn't streamed for a while, at least a month. I thought he was gonna stream earlier, 
I might have to ask uh, some of his, uh, his circle to figure out where he's gone. Still active in his Discord. I'm not in his Discord. Fuck. I'm in a friend of his Discord. Friend of his Discord. God, I can't fucking pronounce that. I haven't figured out where he is. Um, I'll probably try to ask him where he's been. And I'll make sure that he's comfortable with me telling people um, where he's been. Because I also want to know where he's been. I just saw in his announcements. Oh, then I guess he is totally comfortable. Totally comfortable with uh, letting people know. Uh, what does it say? He's been moving or something. Oh, fuck yeah. Dude, moving is always really exciting. And, and for a content creator, I can only imagine like the kind of shit he has planned for his streams. Check off topic. Working hard to get my room done to get back to streaming. I feel more sweaty than a League of Legends player. <laughs> yeah. The, I mean, here's the thing, right? Imagine the crazy things he could do in his new setup, right? His new, his new place. I mean... May dress stream? Where he wears... Two maid dresses at the same time? Imagine. Imagine. Heaven forbid three. Actually, he, he's done a maid dress stream, right? I know he had the fucking cat ears at one point. I know he did that. I was made him talk a voice when he called his mom. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't believe. I can't believe you would do that. You would do that to Goron, man. I can only imagine what his mom thinks. Damn. Pay any you can pay channel points to make him change into maid dress and wear cat ears, and I did that to him. You're evil, you know that? You're fucking evil. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking probably tomorrow. Uh, my, his mom called him a clan. Uh, hey, at least you didn't. At least she didn't disown him, right? He didn't deny him. <laughs> yeah, just Garon, just being a little prankster. He's just being a little. Just, just, just being a little, little prankster. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe tomorrow we could probably play uh, the final station again, finish that off. Or we could do a more Rain World. I want to get on to playing other games and going into different categories because I think I'm, I've am i been stagnating. I haven't really gained a lot of followers in a while. Uh, we haven't really seen any new faces. And honestly, I think we're actually losing viewers. Okay, anyways, good night and good luck. Because it's now 4.08 a.m. That's totally fair, and it's a shame that we can't... I'm going to try, just for now, I'm just going to send off a raid. I'm going to see. I need to sleep. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Maybe there are some people in my, in my chat that are, like, hiding that I actually... Damn, just like a, few, a week or two ago, we had like seven or eight. Damn. This person isn't even talking. Damn it. I'm joining the raid if you're doing one, though. Yeah, it's fair. I'm just trying to find somebody, though. That's the problem. Someone that's interacting with chat. Someone that's actually talking. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and raid this person. Uh, I'm going to hit raid and let, let's see what number shows up. If it's like, if it's less than three, I don't really want to send one off unless it's like a decent amount. Okay, three. 
that okay that that actually will like we're gonna double their viewership they're at four right now i'll just send you guys off to see you guys tomorrow we'll decide what we're gonna be playing goodbye